Mexican queso chicken. Mm. It's what's for dinner tonight. It's Taco Tuesday, and in this house, that means pretty much taco adjacent. <laughs> we don't always do taco night, but we do do something uh, in the taco Mexican kind of family. Um, but we're not a spicy family. We, we don't like it spicy. So I, I come up with dishes like this. So tonight, it's queso chicken. So look, I've been having some problem with my camera recording. So I have already got it together, but I'm going to walk you through the steps, okay? <laughs> I have got four pieces of chicken down here in the bottom of, you know, my, my handy dandy full pan. Uh, the pan was really too big for just four pieces of chicken. I didn't have a smaller one. So I took some foil and I put it right there on the side of it and kind of made this pan smaller so that all the goodness is going to be right there on top of that chicken. Now, I took those four pieces of chicken stuck in the, night in the refrigerator this morning in a vat of buttermilk. So I've had it marinating in buttermilk all day and now it's ready to make the yummy goodness. On the chicken, I added some salt and pepper and then about two tablespoons of some taco seasoning. I get the great big one from Costco because, I mean, it's Costco, right? <laughs> then comes the easy part. We're going to take a can of drained Rotel. Of course, the Walmart brand. It's, you know, cheap stuff, right? Put about a half a can of that on top. Then we're going to take a can of queso sauce. I got this from the Dollar Tree, y'all. I mean, seriously, it's quick, easy, cheap. Dollar Tree, pour that on top of the tomatoes, put some more tomatoes on top and the rest of the cheese. And then we're going to take and add some shredded cheese. Now, I usually will use the Mexican Fiesta cheese blend. Um, I guess I'm out. I don't know how I've got eight bags of shredded cheese in there. None of them are the Mexican Fiesta blend, but that's all right. So we're just going to use my regular shredded cheese, put that on top. Um, just, just enough to make your heart happy, really. <laughs> and it's, it's as simple as that. It's ready to go in the oven. So they got that oven preheated for 375 degrees. We're going to stick it in there just long enough to get the chicken done, which will be about 30, 35 minutes. So here we go. So while that's cooking, I'm going to make it some rice. And when the chicken's done, then I'll be ready to serve. And here we go. It's been about 35 minutes. This chicken is nice and done. It smells so good. It smells so good. I got the rice right here. I'm going to cut some of this chicken up, plate it in a bowl, and uh, it's time for dinner, y'all.